the rebel army. What's up guys and welcome to part 3 of my playthrough of the Tekken 7 story mode. I feel it's really good so far. Uh, really like the artwork, the visuals, the graphics of the game are amazing. The script works kind of well. It's kind of... the plot is interesting. It's 50 times better than Scenario Campaign from Tekken 6. So I'm just guessing Heihachi is dead, like killed by Akuma and that, that's... Whoa, quite a shocker to me. I mean, obviously I should have seen, been able to see it happen, but it's such a big thing, you know. He actually is quite the legendary character, and he's killed by a Street Fighter character, Akuma. And now we have uh, the heroes uh, uh, assembled. Like, you have Lars and Lee together with Alisa, and they have Jin. The hatred I had held deep inside surged through my veins like a tidal wave. Jin had put the wheels in motion that led to me losing everything. Then, as if finally putting his feelings into words, Lars muttered, There was no mistaking what he had said. So, they, yeah, they re of course really want to protect Jin. He is their hero. He's the good. What the fuck? Oh, he yeah, actually is alive. <laughs> we're like, where is he? Oh, <laughs> Classic Heihachi. Like, you think he's dead, you know? You could drop a nuclear weapon on Heihachi. And he... He would show up... On another continent, like... A blast can throw him like 28 miles, but you just know several weeks later he's just going to crawl out from the earth and go like... And is now baying for Kazuya's blood, so the... So he thinks Heihachi is dead. But I mean everyone thought Heihachi was dead in Tekken 5, even Raven, you know, in there. Uh, story mode interlude, he faces Heihachi and he's like, what, you're still alive? Why is Heihachi impossible to kill? He has no devil gene, but... He's alive. That was the first thing I thought when I saw him. He's... <sighs> Jesus Christ. I took the opportunity to quietly pocket a screwdriver. The man who had stolen everything from me lay before my eyes. An opportunity like this may never present itself. Yeah, exactly. I mean, now this is the perfect opportunity. Jin is in a coma. It was as if Lars could read my mind. He explained that when Jin woke up, he would try to use Jin's power to put a stop to all the fighting. All I could do was nod in agreement. Okay, so Jin is basically the chosen one. The one that can stop the evil Heihachi and Kazuya. And obviously he was able to do so a long time ago. After the fourth King of Iron Fist tournament. But he chose to spare them. He thought of his mother and he chose to spare them. So I guess he regrets that now, and this time he's going to finish them. Oh, oh, they're going to broadcast Kazuya using his devil form. And when Kazuya is dead and buried, you bastard! I, I, if Kazuya dies... Oh my god, don't do this to me. Akuma failed to kill Heiachi, 
But he thinks he has killed Heihachi. Heihachi is still alive, so now Akuma... Wanting to fulfill his, his promise to Kazumi... He's gonna kill Kazuya. But did Kazuya buy that? So Kazuya thinks Heihachi is dead as well? This is actually really exciting. I mean, this story mode is working for me. <laughs> Don't waste your time. You're no match for him. He's just standing there. Kurosmanistotskito she saved his life. <laughs> Kazuya, you bastard. You wonderful bastard. No! I wanna play as Kazuya, what the fuck? Oh, look how badass his uh, artwork, his portrait is there at the top. I want that one for on online mode. I didn't want to show you him. I don't want to do this. electric action oh fuck lazy work <laughs> Look at the devil Kazuya character portrait. So fucking cool. Let's step back. Lazy worm. What the hell is going on? 
三島和也がデビル化した映像複数のカメラで捉えましたふん<笑>とはいえカズミはもういない全てを終わったこと最終承認システム起動これで終わりじゃおやすみ form of fucking iron cannon <laughs> okay, so that was his plan all along. <laughs> Holy shit! I couldn't take my eyes off the live broadcast. Next to me, Lee and Lars barked orders frantically, desperately trying to verify whether the images were a hoax or not. The demon on screen was unlike anything I'd imagined. No, it was something much more horrific. The devil incarnate. The demon-like creature you see on your screens is apparently Kazuya Mishima, said to be controlling G Corporation from the shadows. World leaders are currently debating whether to believe. The reports just in that the creature has been subdued by the Mishima Zaibatsu. I'd long assumed this war was between humans. That my family, my hometown, had been razed to the ground by people. Ho esaudito le tue richieste. Ora non posso fare altro. The super laser iron cannon beam of death from hell, you know, blows up the entire fucking G Corporation headquarters. But Kazia survives, he's at the bottom of the rubble, and all he has to say is, You dare to attack me. Public opinion is turning against us. So he has another headquarters, or. <laughs> Holy shit. That's all he had to do. <laughs> he went to the building and lasers down the Hachi satellite. His eyesight and the aim are fucking impressive. But can you defeat Heihachi? I mean, you both seem to be fucking unkillable. How? I mean, I... I don't know how this is going to end, honestly. But I do know that when Jin wakes up, shit's gonna go down. Yeah, but exactly, you, you killed your you killed your son. I mean, damn you, Kazuya, but you killed your your wife and son. The atrociousness of the fighting was inconceivable to the average person. I mean, you, you killed his mother and then you attempted to kill him when he was just a child, trying to avenge his mother. You. The concept of good and evil changed every day. And he's going to blame Kazia for that? I was probably the only person on the planet not paying attention to him. To 
me, evil was that which had taken everything away from me, and I couldn't rest until I put a stop to it. So I went directly to the Mishima Zaibatsu's headquarters and told them I would expose them for what they are. I knew I was risking my life just to be laughed off. But I couldn't stand by and watch the world descend further into chaos. Still, they paid me no attention. Bereft of all hope, I wandered around town aimlessly. But then, a man dressed in black approached me silently and told me that Heihachi had agreed to meet me. Oh. A few hours later, I was placed in a car and driven in a completely different. He's gonna meet up with Heihachi. When I arrived at my destination, Heihachi Mishima was there waiting for me. So our journalist is going to meet up with Heihachi. Sama, Mishima no oh, he is going to take Heihachi to Jin, I guess, or something. At that time, I had no idea why Heihachi had suddenly agreed to meet with me. His eyes latched onto mine, filling me with unshakable fear. I have delved deep into the history of the Mishimas from Jinpachi Mishima to the family's connection to Kazumi Hachijo. The year you declared the establishment of the Mishima Zaibatsu was the same year your wife Kazumi passed away and that your son sustained terrible injuries from falling off a cliff. To me, that sounds like one hell of a coincidence now, doesn't it? Oh, so now suddenly we actually have uh, our hero in 3D. At that time, I had no idea why he wanted me to reveal everything on his behalf. But I was getting so close to the truth I had long fought to uncover that I couldn't turn down this once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. The devil's blood in Kazuya and the blood of Kazumi's family, the Hachijos, remains shrouded in mystery. I listened closely to every word, each step inching closer to the truth. あやつが わしらは幸せじゃった。特にカズミはカズヤのことを目に入れても痛くないほど溺愛しておった。すべての歯車が狂ったのは貴様の言う通り、その年のこと。So <笑> what the fuck happened? カズミが突然倒れおった。カズミは信じられぬほどの高熱を出しており。she tried to kill you? うん。じゃが翌日、熱が下がった それはまるで人格を二つ抱えた人間と共におるような感覚じゃった。そんな日が幾日も続いそしてある日。ぴょん。ほっ。うん。せい。カズミ。貴様は優勢。世界を脅かす存在。
なぜ我がこの家に嫁いだのかまさか<笑>我ら八条家は貴様のような人間を消すために太古から存在しておるその使命を今果たす Bastard. <sighs> okay, so I feel for Herche. Kazumi is the asshole. Ah, uh, this fight is kind of hard. Is that a ten hit? Punished it. What she hit me? Oh, the bullshit. This fight is kind of difficult. I can't dodge that! And of course, no juggles allowed. Why do I even bother with launchers? This, this is a nightmare. I mean, Jinpachi was kind of bad as the Tekken 5 uh, final boss, he was hard, but at least you could juggle him.
Kazmi. You got a feel for Ayatshi there. So that's how you killed your wife. Motomoto was she who crossed the many Mishima can you put at a woman? Not of a Hanakara Kurosun. But why did she give him a son before trying to kill him? He was just an innocent boy. Kazumi no Chiu gets him another. Ning in the night of Kangai. Oto Seva Shinu de Aro Gagani Otos. Oh, right. Okay, so that explains that. Right, so how do you know about that? Let me go! Just let me know one thing! What does this war mean to you? That's voice acting. When I came to, I was on a wharf with Lars. I had no idea where Very I was. Very dramatic. He was doing there. Lars said he'd received a message from the Zaibatsu telling him to come here. He bundled me into his car and then took me back to Violet Systems. As we drove back, Heihachi's words ran through my mind over and over. Why did he let me interview him like that? Why did he leave everything to me? And what was that mournful look in his eyes? Question upon question whirled through my mind, but not a single answer. And when is Jin going to awake? Like, he's been... Talk about AF AFK for a while. Lots of shit going down and Jin is just... Um, Everything went down. Only bound to a bed. Later. I couldn't believe what I was seeing. <laughs> Lee was fervishly trying to ascertain Heihachi's whereabouts. Eventually, his spy satellite spotted him and transmitted a picture to us. I stood there in shock. The man I'd spoken to was somewhere unbelievable. Oh, the final fight at the Devil's Pit. Shinibashi <laughs> <laughs> 
this is the final fight. I love a double health with Kazuya. But now I suddenly I gotta root for Heihachi. Did they have to make him a good guy? <laughs> But how could Kazuya know better? He had his mother killed. I'm rooting for both sides. Don't do this. No break. Got to be kidding me. Oh my god, what's with the unblockables, Kazuya? What? Can I play this Kazuya? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let's try this again. Kazuya too fucking strong, it's useful. I mean, what mode is this? It's like Devil Kazuya, except he's not.
Okay, so proper devil Kazia form, super powerful. Uh, this is the final fight of all Mishima final fights. Holy hell. This is pretty epic.
my god. Oh fuck. You lose. Oh my god, I'm getting so fucking wrecked. Good start. Perfect start actually. Well, Heihachi has an uphill battle here. I am happy I picked the hardest difficulty, but this fight is pretty fucking hard. You're kidding. Oh, these power crush moves on like every attack. Try to sidestep. I step, but I get no punish. Unlimited rage drives. 
get no sidestep. I get the camera switch. I gotta tell you, this fight is seriously difficult. I don't know what to do about this fight. He can just power crush everything I do. I don't know what to do, honestly. It's so difficult. That he had power crush on his way down, so I couldn't even punish the fucking laser. I mean how bullshit 
is that? You lose. He does a twin pistons. I'm gonna punish, but he power crushes right into a rage art. I'm dead. Okay, I, when he goes into rage mode, he is invincible. Like, almost undodgeable. I don't dare do a combo, because I know he's going to get out of it. Now, what can I do? Like, look, oh, I get rage again. So you have to bait the rage, block it, because otherwise it's just unbeatable. That's a good start. Still, I eat it. Okay, here we go. Now I just gotta block. I have to bait this fucking rage art. There we go. No launch. Your fucking rage art, please. Are oh, you sneaky fuck? Do the rage art! Do the rage art! <laughs> Thank fucking God! That was my pad.
What the fuck? Truth be told, I'm lucky to still be alive. No normal person could understand the reality of everything I've seen. The truth of it all. So that's everything Kazuya is after all of this. I'm just one just person, pure evil. But it is my job as a reporter to get the truth out. Which is exactly why I'm writing this piece now. Rip Payachi, I guess. One day, so he actually pretty much ends up being a, fi a fucking hero. I mean, that, that's what I'm take what I take from this. I mean, the world will be at peace. Sure, he's done some evil shit, but. Can you blame him after his wife tries to kill him? Did I miss something? So... No Jin in story mode. Is Akuma killed by that uh, satellite beam? What so evil prevails? He actually tries to rid the world of devils and... He's defeated by Kazuya. And Kazuya rules the world, or but Jin is still alive, right? Something has to be off here. はい。各地で進行を開始しています。このままでは。<laughs> and an Oscar Wilde quote.
Oh, awesome. Oh, the, that wasn't the hardest difficulty. Okay, so I'm gonna play the special chapter, but I'm gonna do that in uh, another video. And uh, so I'm gonna cut it here. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, really enjoyed story mode. I, th I thought it was really great. It wasn't the longest, but uh, quality over quantity in my opinion. And I thought it was fucking great. Cheers guys.